In this video, I'm going to show you a CSS rule that will help keep your website mobile compatible. Brought to you by MySites.Guru. Get a free site audit for your Joomla site at MySites.Guru. Hey there Joomla fans, Tim Davis here. I'm a Joomla fan too. Thanks for tuning in to the Basic Joomla Tutorials YouTube channel, where I show you my favorite extensions, tools, and tips for building and maintaining Joomla sites. I also work on Joomla sites and migrate them, maintain them. So if you're looking to hire someone short-term or long-term, or even just to get you out of a spot, Send me an email, tim at cybersault.com, and let's talk. Okay, today's topic. I had a client who got a notification from Google Search Console saying that one of his pages was not mobile friendly. And when we looked into it, we found that he had a really long URL on a page that was not wrapping in the mobile view and that was breaking things. So let's see how we fix that and how you can fix that and prevent that on your site. All right, so here we are in the Joomla 4 site, and I've just created a page here. You'll notice we've got a super long uh, URL and a long bunch of text here. Now, if I use uh, go to Chrome DevTools by hitting F12, and there we go, and now we use this little button here to preview on mobile. Sometimes you don't get the right width here. We just go and we're going to click on Home, and there we go we'll get the proper width now we get down look the url is not wrapping and this long string of a's is not wrapping there's nowhere for a break in that now here is the fix for that however you add custom css to your joomla template you want to add this code now i'm going to add it to cassiopeia the default template in joomla where you put custom css and to do that you go to system and then to site templates click on Cassiopeia details and files. And what you want to do is go to CSS, the folder CSS uh, in media template site Cassiopeia, and then into the user.css file. Now, if you've never put custom CSS in Cassiopeia, you need to create that file. Anyways, we will click on there and I'm going to paste the code in. I have it all ready to go. You'll see it is P for paragraph, uh, comma, space a which is for link and then we have our left brace word wrap break word and the right uh, bracket and the rest we just leave for notes so we know what it does we're simply going to save that we're going to go up to here and now we will just refresh this page and you'll see now the link is wrapping the long text is wrapping and this page is now mobile friendly and that's what we want I hope that helped. Be sure to subscribe to get more helpful tutorials.